Hello, College 9 and 10 students. My name is Kate Gonzaga. My pronouns are she, her, hers. I am a second year legal studies major. Hi, everyone. My name is Andrea Duran. My pronouns are she, they. I am a fifth year in the Critical Race and Ethnic Studies Department. We are happy to be interning for College 9 and 10 this year. And part of our internship is to create a welcoming space for all 9 and 10 students. Originally hosted as a club with an emphasis for student community activism, we've decided to evolve this already existing space into one that emphasizes the radical power of self-care. We cannot pour from an empty cup, and the goal of this club, Slugs for Self-Care, is to give student leaders, organizers, and visionaries a space to learn tools and practices to develop relationships with self. We will be meeting every Wednesday starting October 6th from 6 p.m. to 7 p.m. We'll be experimenting with a hybrid setting to see what best works for the students involved, and we want this space to be as accessible as possible. Some of the topics we'll be discussing include breathwork and meditation and music as a tool for mental relaxation. We'll be preparing activities and discussions as we are most concerned with connecting with you all and having fun. We hope to see you there. Hi, I'm Jack. Welcome to the 910 Garden. If you're in the mood to see some cool plants and meet some cool people, you should visit. We're located across the street from the health center and right next to the Terry Fritas Cafe, so stop by any time. We are located on the land of the Amamutsun Tribal Band. The college's 9 and 10 garden aims to create and maintain an accessible and welcoming garden space for UCSC students to learn and grow. Our focus is to promote community building, food wellness, sustainability, and social environmental justice. Workshops and events in collaboration with on and off campus experts will promote an educational space and platform for community leaders, students, and scholars alike to interact with and educate our community. Additionally, we provide students with a stress-free zone to study and engage in gardening practices to support their well-being. I hope you guys come to the 9th Garden this fall. Everybody, my name is Kyle Benad Casar. I'm a fourth year undergrad student here at UC Santa Cruz, and I'm studying cognitive science and AI. And I'm also the Praxis coordinator for the upcoming year. So I wanted to tell you guys a little bit about Praxis. So Praxis is a service learning club here at UC Santa Cruz's College 9 and 10 that aims to address social injustice in our community. And our vision is to build and foster relationships with different community partners to strengthen our community as a collective. And we promote justice. We examine structures of power, privilege, and oppression in our communities. And our values stem from Praxis theory, where we aim to combine uh, academic theory and practice. And that's a really cool part of the learning process. So if you're interested and you want to come out and join us, please come out. We're going to meet every single Tuesday at 7 p.m. Uh, so come out, build community, and volunteer with us. Enjoy some snacks in the meantime. And uh, really, you know, just, just be out there. So if you are interested, please email acer910 at ucsc.edu. That, again, that's H-A-C-E-R the number nine, the number 10, at ucsc.edu. And I hope to see you all there. All right, bye. Hello, my name is Nicholas Mendez. I am the president for Student Nine Senate. Uh, I am a third year studying cognitive science and politics at UC Santa Cruz. And I would like to welcome you all to Senate. Uh, Senate is a fantastic space that I have personally been in since, uh, I think my very first day actually, um, at college nine and ten uh as of welcome week uh and it's one like of my favorite places that i've actually had a chance um uh, an opportunity to be in since i've been at santa cruz um 
we uh, take a really amazing active role in uh, student life here at Colleges 9 and 10. Uh, for those who have been on campus before, they, uh, you'll know that we have planned um, several different uh, like uh, major events in the College 9 and 10 space, such as the College Nights, which of course, uh, unfortunately, are not being done this year. Though we are going to work to um, try and uh, plan other events similar to that that the community can enjoy. But yeah, in short, um, they said it's an amazing space that allows uh, individuals from the community to uh, take an active role and enrich the community and use the resources that we have to really make sure that everyone uh, in the college can really have just a great college experience um, and can actually learn to take an active role in uh, student government as well. Hi, my name is Farah Garcia and I'm a second year political science major as well as a, the VP of External Affairs at our College Nine Senate. The College Night Senate is a space for student leaders to meet and discuss matters that affect our selected college. We talk about any problems that the general student population at College 9 may face, as well as come up with ideas in which we can engage with the student population more. We are constantly striving to create a strong community in College 9, and the Senate is a space where we share these ideas. As VP of External Affairs in our College 9 Senate, I am in charge of representing the College 9 space in meetings with our other colleges. I meet and socialize with a lot of representatives from other colleges. Additionally, I represented College 9 in our Student Union Assembly, or SUA, a place led and funded by students that deal with student affairs and concerns. College 9 is a special place for me because it helped me integrate with the school despite COVID and being quarantined. I know I can always depend on my peers at the College 9 Senate, and I know they'll always be there for me. Hi, my name is Kaylee and I'm College's 9th student Senate VP in Finance. In my role, I oversee financial records and help to project future plans, investments, and activities for my community. Apart from being able to gain a new skill each day, I love how c 9 Senate has always been a welcoming space where I'm able to connect with leaders within my community and build long-lasting friendships at the same time. Hi, I'm Alex. I'm a politics major and the public relations board member for College 9. I make posters, update the Senate website, and post on our Instagram. If you want updates on events and what we as a Senate are doing, follow us at C9 Senate. I would highly recommend joining this space. Over the past year, it was one of the few things that helped me during such isolating times. It was a great community and is something I look forward to every week. I hope to see you all soon. Hey, Ben and Slugs. My name is Peter. I use he, him, his pronouns. I'm a second year environmental science major. And here at College 9, I am your vice president of internal affairs. And my job includes taking the meeting minutes, planning our retreats, and updating our bylaws and constitution as needed. And one of the things I really love about this space is that I get to make new friends and work on my leadership skills at the same time. Well, I'll see you all on campus. Hi, my name is Isabella Crespin. And I'm Nicole Britton, and we are the 2021-2022 PAC leads. Um, so you're probably asking what exactly is PAC? Well, PAC is short for the Practical Activism Conference, and it is a day-long annual event held every winter quarter that focuses on activism and how to get involved in one's community. Um, this is done through student-led workshops and seminars that focus on social justice issues like indigenous people's rights, climate change, and having access to clean water and food. If that's not exciting enough, last year our keynote speaker was the brilliant Angela Davis, and although this speak year's speaker hasn't been announced yet, we'll be sure to have a good one. Yeah, so there's many benefits to PAC. So PAC is a two-unit course that's super easy to fit into your schedule. It gives students the opportunity to learn leadership skills since the conference is run by and created by students. The skills you learn are how to organize and create the conference. They're all amazing job skills to have once you graduate. PAC also gives you the opportunity to shine a spotlight on the issue that matters to you the most. We hope that this year you'll join us for planning another amazing conference. 